Hello, people. I'm Javi Kowei. Joining me is Casey Ruggieri. Hi. And we are going to look at Voice from the Stone, trailer number one. Some sexuality and nudity. Is that, uh, yeah. Me and the boy. His mother, she died. My son has not spoken since. He saw terrible things. He heard terrible things. Hello, Jacob. My name is Verena, and I'm going to be staying here for a while. I promise I'm not like the others. I'm much worse. <laughs> You've come to make the boy talk. Just to help if I can. Give me your hands. They're strong, like hers. What? Uh oh. Shit's about to get real. <laughs> I assume it's his mother he hears or thinks mm. he hears. You don't believe in such voices. No, Signore, I do not. Jacob doesn't want to hear. He hasn't shown it yet, but he will. Oh boy. <laughs> As you saw last night, he became a danger to himself and to others. No, no. Jacob! The boy is all that matters. The voice is real. No, man. I must leave. No. Verena! She's given me her illness. Oh, Jesus. Uh, Worst nightmare. Uh, Jesus. I want to go now. Please. I would have said that about 30 minutes earlier in the movie. But, uh, I like that. I like that a lot. Yeah, that's um, good. I like that. Well, this, is, this is, I feel like we're getting a new trend. Did you see Get Out? Not yet. Ugh. Get Out's a great movie. Yeah. If you haven't seen it, you should check it out. I will. But Get Out represents something that I like a lot, which is it's, it's a low budget thriller horror in that it keeps things simple and mm -hmm. it's just, it, it's more about the mood and the tone and just getting under your skin yes. more than this visceral graphic violence. Yeah. And so that's what I was recognizing here was that it was just more this creepiness that's slowly unfurling over the course of the film. And by the time the character realizes they should get out, they're already sucked deep into right. this shit. Like, right. it's how do you how do you escape? And so I like the actress. I think she's cool. Yeah. Um, and it seems like from what little we've seen here, the little kids doing mm -hmm. a, an all right job doing this creepy kid. Oh, yeah. Kids are always <laughs> creepy in the horror movies. <laughs> this could be the new Damien from Ugh. like the Omen. <laughs> yeah, and it looks beautiful. It's what, shot wh beautifully. Why are children so creepy in the movies? <laughs> Yeah, that's one I would see for sure. The setting is cool. Yeah. Like, how often do you get a horror movie set in an environment like that? Yeah, the way they shot it looks like it's it, it really is going to stretch the pace and bring the tense, the, make it tense and, you know. Let us know in the comments what you guys thought. I'm interested and I hope it comes to at least an independent theater near me. A few quick shout outs. Sandeep Shivam, all-consuming wonderlust. I like saying that. And AJ, you all have been contributing for a little while now and just want to say a quick thank you to all three of you. Thank you guys so much. Really appreciate you helping out with the Koi family and keeping us going here and putting food on the table. Literally. I'm Jabby Koi. Peace out.